mixture of success and failure for the lads in the ghetto. what she said. That's what she <laughs> said. <laughs> Welcome everyone on this most auspicious of days, for today marks the end of my Honda Melody project. I've just put the final part on. It's one I've been looking for for a while. Quite hard to get hold of and that was the auto-choke mechanism down here. So, she runs like a dream now. She's ready to go. So what have I done? We've had, let's start at the back, a new number plate. We've had a new indicator relay. We've had a whole bunch of cool stickers. Because that's how I roll. I painted the seat black, I fitted this luxurious black interior, more stickers up here, we've had a new speedo cable, we've had a sticker at the front and some go faster stripes, these add at least 5 miles an hour, a new front tyre and a refurbishment on a lot of the original parts. She's had an MOT, I forget how long ago that was, I think it was November. So we've got some left. Let's start her up. Oil light works, and goes out. Oh yes. There she is, the sound of a two-stroke is, well, it's the sound of a two-stroke. She settles down to a nice idle eventually, she's running a little bit cold at the minute. And she is ready to rock and roll, oh yes. Wowzer! <laughs> I'm a real biker now, Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> what a melody! Remember, everybody, when you're riding your two stroke 80 scooter, that you must preserve nature. If you're riding a scooter like this, you have to keep it 80s. The Boy Racer blue and red vacuum hoses add three miles an hour. This one has the original Honda factory rust on the exhaust. Uh, it was a factory option and obviously uh, the first buyer went in for that. This Honda Melody is the deluxe version and that means that it comes with the factory air conditioning. It comes with a Bluetooth CD player. It's got power steering. It has leather seats and it has cruise control and all the other toys that you might imagine on a early 80s vintage two-stroke deluxe scooter. So that's the end of the Honda Melody project. It's just been a little background project for us really. Um, it's taken some time finding the parts but we got there in the end. Uh, so we'll probably be getting rid of this one soon and replacing it with something else that we can keep in the garage for the next six months and not do any work on really. So I uh, hope you can join us for that. If you've got any questions about this one, uh, give us a shout. And if not, we'll see you next time.